They are the men and women who run into homes when they're on fire, doing what they can to save your life and belongings. But firefighters are humans too, and they too can have problems. And that is the case for a local firefighter who's fighting the challenge of his life, one with cancer. 10 on your side's Haley Mylon has his story new tonight. Haley? Yeah, Stephanie, Virginia Beach Fire Captain Matt Cheverotti is battling a rare and aggressive form of thyroid cancer. His friends and colleagues from fire departments across Hampton Roads are coming together to show support to a man they say has done so much for this community. He's a go-getter. He's probably one of the most go-getter, outgoing kind of guys that we have. Go-getter, I uh, said he does 100%. His friends and colleagues say he's got the fight in him to beat anaplastic thyroid cancer. You know, live life at a 10, right? So that's, that's who he is. Biggest personality in the room. Chevrotty joined the Virginia Beach Fire Department 20 years ago, quickly moving up the ranks from rescues in Virginia Beach to crisis response in Haiti with his FEMA task force. His colleagues say he's the best of the best. I guarantee you anybody who's ever worked with Matt um, or has been the recipient of his rescue services remember his face. A husband, father, and hero, the news of his diagnosis shook the firefighting community, including including his best friend, Captain Billy Scott. It hit me very hard. I said, look, man, I, I'm going to lay some heavy stuff on you. They told me he had thyroid cancer. A conversation had by too many firefighters across the country. According to the International Agency for Research on Cancer, firefighting is one of the most dangerous professions because of exposure to carcinogens. We know that prevention is the solution, but until that happens, um, we just have to deal with the consequences and we're all going to rally around him. Standing behind Chevrotti and showing support is the priority right now. Crews from Portsmouth, Chesapeake, Norfolk and Virginia Beach all coming together for the cause. They're givers and he absolutely would be doing the same thing for uh, anybody that was going through that. The effort has already raised over $30,000, and the organizers tell me they're not done yet. The household bills and medical expenses are adding up, and on Wednesday, there's a benefit at CP Shuckers with other events planned for later this month. For more information and to check out the GoFundMe, visit wavy.com. I'm Haley Mylon, 10 on your side.